Chris Tyson is a transgender individual who has recently come into the public spotlight due to his outspoken views on gender and sexuality. While he has been vocal on his support for the transgender community, he has also been criticized for being dismissive of other people's opinions. This has caused some controversy, as many feel it is important to respect the opinions of others, even if they differ from your own. It is important to remember that everyone has the right to their own opinion, and it is important to have constructive dialogue and discussion when it comes to differing views. Ultimately, it is important to be open-minded and respectful when discussing matters of opinion, as this can lead to meaningful conversations and growth. By seeing the thumbnail most of you already know what this topic is about for those who don't know it is how Chris Tyson wants to be accepted as a trans but at the same time does not respect other people's opinions. But before we get into today's episode please like and subscribe to my channel for more amazing videos. Chris Tyson decided to make it even harder for people to support him as Chris recently sparked outrage after posting on Snapchat a photo of his two-year-old son wearing high heels. People were extremely upset when they saw the photo, and many criticized Taylor for subjecting his son to such a controversial fashion choice. Posts sparked conversations about the effects of gender stereotyping on children, and the importance of allowing them to make their own choices. Behavior should be condemned as it is unacceptable. The revelation that he had bought art from known pedophiles has caused a great deal of outrage among people, who have deemed his actions both immoral and irresponsible. Taylor has since apologized and promised to never purchase artwork from pedophiles again. But the damage to his reputation may be irreversible. Furthermore, Chris Day has been accused of racism due to his past comments and actions, such as making derogatory remarks about certain ethnic groups, denying the concept of multiculturalism and using offensive language to describe people of different backgrounds. In response to these allegations, he must take responsibility for his words and actions and work to be more inclusive and respectful of people from all backgrounds. Most of us know his hatred for Muslims. Negative stereotypes perpetuated by the media and political figures. Muslims are often depicted as violent and oppressive, which is used to justify discrimination and prejudice against them. Additionally, individuals may be influenced by their own biases and misunderstandings, leading them to generalize and assume that all Muslims are the same. YouTuber Mr. Beast praised his team's Muslim cameraman Tariq, noting his dedication to his religion and the sense of something greater he felt when observing him. However, Chris Tyson who also works with Mr. Beast has shown extreme hatred toward Islam in tweets on social media, displaying his disagreement with Mr. Beast's views. Here are some of his tweets that show how much hatred is filled inside him. This specific tweet has a picture of the Holy Book of Muslim. Chris Tyson should ask himself why people are converting to Islam rather than questioning his followers. If Islam is supposedly barbaric, filled with hatred and violence, and treats women in a derogatory manner, why is it growing so rapidly? Celebrities like El Hamer, who had money and fame, left their careers in the glamorous industry to accept Islam, showing that it can be attractive and desirable to many. Rather than judging people and their choices, Chris should learn to respect others regardless of their color, race, gender, or religion. This is especially true considering recently Chris was attacked for undergoing a hormone replacement surgery to become a trans woman, and he labeled his haters as transphobic. Is this not hypocrisy coming from someone who is now accused of being Islamophobic? People like Chris Tyson should understand the importance of respecting others and not judging those who are different from them. Respect others so that they can respect you back and with that we come to an end with today's episode please like and subscribe to my channel for more amazing videos. Thank you for watching.